Hello and welcome to the order entry tutorial. In this video I will show you how to enter an order. As you can see I have already logged into my account and I am at the home screen. From here if you would like to look at the shopping list before you make an appointment click on print shopping list. This will give you an option to print a PDF version of the shopping list. If you already have an appointment or a scheduled delivery you will click on order entry on the right side of the page. At this screen if you are picking up your order at the food bank warehouse, you will enter the date and time of the appointment that you have with our office. You cannot order for pickup unless you have an appointment. If you have a scheduled delivery, please enter the date of your delivery and 12 p.m. for the time. In this example, I will enter Friday, January 24th at 11.30 a.m. Now I can press continue to view the shopping list. From here you will be able to add items to your cart. If you would like to learn different ways to sort the inventory, please watch the tutorial on sorting the inventory list which is on our website. You can also refer to the PWW manual which is also on our website. For this example, I will go down the list and add various items to my cart. To add an item to your cart, simply click in the empty box under quantity and enter a number for how many of that item you would like. As you can see at the top, it will keep a running total of the amount of items that you have, the total weight, and the service fees that go along with the items that you choose. I'm going to add a few more items to my cart. At this point, you can see at the top that I have five items in my cart. The total weight is 469 pounds, and the service fees will be $29.88. You do have two options for removing something from your cart. Your first option is to click in this box and select off, and it will remove that item from your cart. Another option you have for removing an item is to click this red X next to the product. As you can see in the totals reflected here, those items have been removed from my cart. Looks like I'm all done with this example order, so I will go up to the top here and click on View Cart. At this screen, you'll be prompted to enter your contact information, and you can also confirm that you have entered the correct time for your pickup or delivery. You'll also see here that you have an order status, which at this point will be Entry Not Complete, Must Check Out. I'll now go ahead and enter some contact information. If I scroll down to the bottom, I can also review the items that I have in my cart. At this point, if you see that you added an item accidentally, or if there's something on there that you don't want, you can also remove the item at this stage as well. So again, I will click on the red X to remove that item from my order. So now I have two items on my order. They are both things that I would like, and I will click on Checkout. As you can see, you are taken to a confirmation screen where you will get your order reference number, and you can also click for a PDF summary of your order. That is all for this training tutorial. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.